So buying a historic home is not for the faint of heart. I can personally attest to that. I have purchased two myself. Um, I'm a huge historic home lover. I think that they are amazing properties. I think the craftsmanship, the building of them, I think it's, it's unmatched. Um, I have two homes that I actually purchased that are over 120 years old. And it's just amazing the way that these homes are built. However, you are dealing with a lot of old things uh, typically in these properties. And so I think that finding number one, a home inspector that is comfortable with, with looking at older homes and knows, has a lot of knowledge about how these systems work and how they work whenever they were originally built. There are a lot of things that are very different. I think you also have to have a healthy budget um, for repairs and upgrades as time goes on. Um, but I think in the end, if you, if you have the, the tolerance for things like that, if you understand that there are going to be things that are probably going to go wrong down the road, but on the upside, you're getting a property that has so much, you know, curb appeal and potential and all the extras that come in. I've got a couple of properties with some of the most amazing crown molding and coffered ceilings that I've ever seen and I've certainly never seen on a new house. So there is a lot of upside, but I would just say to, you know, be tolerant of the fact that you are gonna have issues that do come up and have a healthy budget for the repairs that, you know, may come up that might be unexpected.